Hi guys, it is Monday, October 28th, and it's also National First Responders Day. I want to say thank you to all of our first responders, and thank you for joining News Channel 20 Marketplace. I'm Benny Harmony. Let's get into our trending stories. Up first, a North Carolina man cannot believe his luck. Last Tuesday, Jerry Hicks went to a convenience store and found $20 laying in the parking lot. Well, then Hicks went into the store and bought a scratch off lottery ticket. Turns out that ticket was worth a million dollars. Hicks claimed his prize on Friday. He's opting to get a lump sum payment instead of getting smaller amounts over 20 years. Hicks is from Banner Elk near the Blue Ridge Mountains of North Carolina. He has spent his life as a carpenter and says he plans to use the money to help his children retire after 56 years on the job. How sweet is that? And next, Target is making it easier on your wallet to host Thanksgiving dinner this year. With the prices we are currently seeing in America, this is a great option for families. Target announced today it is offering a meal bundle for just 20 bucks, $5 less than last year. It feeds four people and includes all the traditional Thanksgiving favorites. The bundle includes a frozen turkey of up to 10 pounds, potatoes, canned green beans, cream of mushroom soup, boxed stuffing mix, and jarred gravy. Target also says it is offering deals on other side dis dishes such as macaroni and cheese and desserts including apple and pumpkin pie. Other retailers, including Aldi and Walmart, have previously announced they were also lowering the prices of their Thanksgiving meal deals. And lastly, a viral piece of art that sent social media into an uproar when it sold for more than $100,000 is on sale again. And this time it's expected to fetch up to one and a half million dollars. So this banana duct taped to a wall, it's called Comedian. And in case you're wondering, yes, it's a real banana. I don't know how that happens. Auction House Sotheby said it's a conceptual artwork and the physical materials are replaced with every installation. That means the winning bidder will get a roll of duct tape, a banana, a certificate of authenticity, and official instructions for installing the work. It's one of three editions that sold five years ago at the Art Basel Miami Beach Fair. Two were purchased by private collectors for $120,000. A third was bought at a higher undisclosed sum and later donated to the Guggenheim Museum in New York. The original artist is Maurizio Catalan, who's known for satirical pieces uh, that challenge pop culture. Those are your trending stories for today. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.